Look, I'm... Oh, come on. What's the point? What's the fucking point in any case? I gotta argue with you. I gotta knock heads with a cop. I'm busting my balls, sell your dirt to deadbeats. Money in the mattress. Right? I come back, you can't even keep the contract safe. I gotta go out and fuck this shit. I'm gonna go out and re... Murray's... Uh, leave him alone. He needs a new cig, he'll go out himself. Murray's gonna go out? Yeah, he'll be the president of the company. Just come in from out of town, all right? Okay, okay, okay. Give me the shit. I'm giving you three leads. Three? No, I count two. There's just three leads there. Patel, fuck you. Whoa. Fucking Shiva handed this guy a million dollars, told him sign the deal. He wouldn't sign. And the guy Vishnu too into the box. Fuck you, John. You know your business, I know mine. You're just being an asshole. I find out whose fucking cousin you are. I'm gonna go to him and figure out a way to have your ass. Fuck you. I'm waiting for the new leads. Get the chalk! Get the chalk! I closed them. I closed the cocksucker. Get the chalk! Put me on the board, John. Put me on the Cadillac board, huh? Play it, son. Hey, pick up the fucking chalk. Rick, eight <laughs> units Mountain View. Sold eight Mountain View. You bet your ass. Who wants to go to lunch, huh? Who wants to go to lunch? I'm buying it. Williamson. Eighty-two thousand dollars, twelve grand of my commission. I want Dead Beat Magazine subscription leads. Who? <laughs> Bruce and Harriet Nyborg. Read it. Speak to what the hell happened here? Fuck! I had them on Riverglass. What happened? Eight units. Yeah. Shelly. Ah, big deal. I broke a bad seat. Shelly, the machine with me. That's great. Ah, thank you, George. Hey, grab the phone call, Mitch. They took the phones. Huh? They took the leads, they took the cast, and the contracts. In the lobby. When? Last night, this morning. They took the leads. Beat you with a rubber bat. Cop couldn't find a stick to land in a map. Anybody talks to this asshole is a fucking asshole. You gonna turn states? Fuck you, Ricky. <laughs> I ain't going out today. I'm going home. I'm going home because nothing's accomplished here. Anybody talks to this guy. Guess what the machine did? Fuck the machine. Mountain View, eight units. Cops got no right to talk to me that way. I did not rob the place. Did you hear what I said? Yeah, he closed the deal. Eight units. Mountain. You did that? Yeah. Fuck you. Guess who? When? Just now. Guess who? You just this morning? Harriet and blah blah Nyborg. You did that? Eighty-two thousand dollars. Fuck I asked. I told him. Hey, listen. Hey, I don't want to hear your fucking war stories. Fuck you, Dave. I said you have to believe in yourself. Give me a lead. I'm going out. I'm getting out. Oh, fuck the lead. I'm going home. Hey, fuck me, Bruce. We haven't got a lead. Why not? They took them. They had a fucking garbage any case, the whole goddamn. You know, you look around, you say, this one has so-and-so, I got nothing. Well, why? Why don't I get the opportunities? Did they steal the contract? Fuck you, kid. Harriet, I want to tell you something. What the fuck's that supposed to mean? Would you shut up? I'm telling him something. Can we get some coffee? How you doing? Fine. If anybody's going out, I could use some coffee. You do get the opportunities. What the fuck is that supposed to mean? You do get the opportunities. You get them, as I get them, as everybody Rick, gets them. Rick, that I don't care they stole the contract. Now, I got them in the kitchen. What does that mean? It means, Dave, you haven't closed a good one in a month. None of my business. You want to push me to answer. So you haven't got a contract to get stolen. You're so you got a mean streak in you, Ricky. You know that? Shut the fuck up. Ricky, you got a mean streak in you. And what the fuck are you battling about? You bring that shit up on my volume? If you were on a bad one, I brought it up to you, you'd harbor it. You'd harbor it a long, long while, and you'd be right. Who said fuck the machine? Fuck the machine? Fuck the machine? Fuck the machine! What is this, courtesy class? You fucking nuts. Are you fucking nuts? You're hot, so you think you're the ruler of this place. You wanna... Shut up! You wanna decide who should be dealt with how? Is that it? I come to the fucking office today, get humiliated by some jag-off cop. I get accused of... I get the shit thrown in my face by you, you genuine shit, because you're top name on the board? Is that what I did? Gay? I humiliated you. Oh my god, I'm sorry. Sitting on top of the world. Sitting on top of the world, everything's fucking... Oh, and I don't get a moment to spare for some bust-out humanitarian down on his luck lately. Oh, fuck you, Dave. You know you got a big mouth. You make a close, this whole place stinks with your farts for a week. 
how much you just ingested. Oh, what a big man you are. Hey, let me buy you a pack of gum. I'll show you how to chew it. Ooh. Your pal closes all that comes out of your mouth is bile. Ooh. How fucked up you are. Who's my pal? Hmm? What are you? And what are you, Ricky, huh? Bishop Sheen? What the fuck are you, Mr. Slick? Who? What the fuck are you, friend of the working man? Big deal! Fuck you! You got the memory of a fucking fly! I never liked you anyway. What is this, your farewell speech? Going home. Your farewell to the troops? I'm not going home, going to this time. Have a good trip. Oh, fuck you! Fuck the lot of you! Fuck you all! You were saying. Come on. Come on, you got him in the kitchen? You're in your shirt sleeves. You got the stats spread out. You can smell it. Come on, snap up. You're eating her drink. Oh, yeah. How was it? Different Fuck off. Hey, Bruce. To do is admit to ourselves that we see that opportunity and, right? and that's it. Always be closing. Well, that's what I've been saying the old ways, right? Convert that motherfucker, sell him, make him sign the check. Let's go all the way, huh? The whole route. I take it and plat it out. Eight units, 82 grand, and I say to them, this is now. This is that thing that you have been dreaming of. You are gonna find the suitcase on the train. The man walks in the room. That bag is filled with money. Harriet, this is it. And Bruce, I don't wanna fuck around. No, I don't. I don't wanna pussyfoot around, huh? You think you gotta look back on this thing? I do, too. Now, I'm here to do good for you and me, the both of us. What is the point of some interim position? The only arrangement that I will accept is full Investment, and I mean it, that's it. All eight units, period. I got the hand in my hand, Rick. Hey, I turned that contract around. That's eight units, 82 units. I said, now, don't you need to sign? I sat there for five minutes. Then I sat. 22 minutes by that kitchen clock on the wall. Ricky, not a word, not a motion. And what am I thinking? Is my arm getting tired? No, I did it. Just like the old days, like I used to, like I was taught, I did it. Like you taught me. Oh, hey, no, I didn't be able to. Well, if I did, I'm glad. <laughs> what I did, I locked on them. I locked all on them, nothing on me, on them. And oh, God, I am holding my last thought. Oh, fucking Christ. It was like they wilted all at once. No gesture, nothing, just together. I forgot. We both kind of imperceptibly in that slump. You know, and then he reached through to bend me inside. It was solemn, fucking smooth. I let it sit. And then I nodded. Then I pointed into the living room. Sideboard. I didn't know there was a fucking sideboard in there. He went over it. He brought us back a drink. Uh, little shot glasses, you know, with a pretty design in them. A little... I just toasted the silence. Great sale, Shelly. Fuck! Hand me out! Come on, give me leads. Williams is hey, hey, hey. The leads are coming. Get them to me. I talked to Mitch and Mary an hour ago. They're coming in. You understand? They're a bit upset. Shut up my sale. I'm going to tell them your sale. I didn't have a telephone. I'll tell them your sale when they bring in the leads. All right, Shelly? All right? We have a sale for you. Oh, better than a good sale. Look, I have a lot of things on my mind. You understand? They're coming in. They're very upset. I'm trying to make... All I'm telling you is you can tell them it was a remarkable sale. Yeah, the other thing remarkable about it is who you made it for. What the fuck does that mean? I mean, if the sale sticks, it'll be a miracle. But you said to them, why shouldn't the sales... Oh, fuck you. That's, that's, you do not know your job. Do you know that? A man is his job. You are fucked at yours. You hear what I'm saying to you? You're end of the month, fucking boy. You do not know how to run this office. You haven't got the sense. You haven't got the balls. 
Have you ever been on a set? Is this cocksucker ever been on a set? Did you if ever see with I a would customer? Calm down. Oh, would you? Oh my God! What are you going to do? Fire me? Oh, 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 Rick! Oh, it's not impossible. Oh, really? On an eighty thousand dollar day? And what? It's not even noon yet. You closed them today? Oh, I got up early this morning. I tracked them down and I closed it. What I'm saying to you is that things change, and that's where you fuck up because you don't know. You can't look back. You don't see who's coming. Maybe it's someone new, huh? Maybe it's someone else, but you don't know. You can't look back because you don't know your history. When we were on Rio Rancho, who was the top oh, man, huh? For what, oh, two months, three months? How about eight months for three years in a row, huh? And on what, what? Was that it, John? Or purloined fucking leads? It was talent. Yes. Door to door. It's called cold calling, John. Shit, I don't even know their name. They don't want to buy what I've got. Soft sell shit. We were doing it before we even had a name for it. Am I right? You wouldn't know. You <laughs> Jesus, he doesn't even know what a streak is. What the hell are you? You're a fucking secretary. Fuck you! Yeah, that's my message to you. Fuck you and kiss my ass. And if you don't like that, baby, I go across the street and I speak to Jerry Grant. Here you Fuck you. Listen to me. You put me on that fucking board and I want three promising leads for the day and I don't want any bullshit about them and I want them close together because I am going to close them all. He's right, Williamson. I'm sorry, but it's wrong. And you know whose fault it is? Mitch and Murray. Let's get some lunch, huh, Rick? Please won't be up here till later anyway. Your client. I just sold you five waterfront Glengarry farms. I do this with my hair. Throw me to cute Kimball. Which is it? Kimball. I mean, I own the property. My mother owns the property. I put her into it. You look on the plats, you go home. Uh, you'll see. A3, A10, Take your time. I'm still free. No one else. Oh, hey, I won't need more time. I got more time. Don't you? Jim, what are you doing here? Jim Link? Uh, D. Ray Morton. I'm glad to meet you. I just put Jim at the Black Creek. Are you acquainted with you? Hey, Black Creek? No. Uh, oh, in Florida. Yes. I'd like to speak to you about that. Well, we'll do that this week. My wife suggested I look here. Yeah, it's beautiful. Beautiful rolling land. I was telling Jim and Ginny. Ray, I gotta tell you something. Ray, you, you eat in a lot of restaurants. Ray, I know you do. Ray is with American Express. Can I tell Jim what you do? Sure. Ray is director of all European sales and service in America. What well, I'm saying is, you haven't had a meal until you taste it. I was at the Lynx. What was that service feature? Do you wish? Home cooking. What did... Uh, you, had a, you had a tag phrase that you used? Cooking. Home uh, uh, The monthly interview. The magazine. Yes. Oh. Well, I, Is that some <laughs> February issue, but I'll go ahead. Are you sure?